a friend of mine just showed me a really cool plugin called the Advanced Scene Switcher, which you can find here. I've only scratched the surface, but I found something really cool and I kind of want to share it with you. Inside OBS here, we're going to hit the plus key. We're going to make a new source. We're going to make a browser source. For now, we'll call it browser. We're going to change the settings to 1920 by 1080. So it fills up the entire canvas. We're going to go to tools, advanced scene switcher, and we're going to make a new macro. And these macros are set up uh, as if statements. So if this condition is met, then we do this condition or this effect. So the top is the condition and the bottom is the effect. So we're going to hit the plus key. We're going to call this clipboard and hit OK. And we're going to create a new if statement. So if clipboard content matches HTTPS colon slash slash, and we're going to hit this key right here to get access to our settings. And we're going to do allow partial match. What this is doing is it's saying if we put anything into our clipboard that has the text HTTPS colon slash slash, which is usually a URL, then we're going to do something. Now, what we're going to do from here, hit a plus key. At the bottom, we're going to modify a source. We're going to do the save settings, or we're, sorry, we're going to modify settings. We're going to modify settings for the browser source that we made, called it browser. We're going to modify the URL text. Now, if we double click browser, we can see that the URL text is this field right here. Width would be this field. Height would be this field. Uh, local file would be this field, you know, things like that. So we're going to modify the URL. We're going to set it to a macro property. And the macro property is the clipboard text that we identified up here. Now, what this means is if I type hello world, and I highlight that text and I copy it, control C, nothing happens. But if I were to do www, uh, sorry, HTTPS colon slash slash www.twitch.tv backslash Falineer, highlight this text and then control C, it changes the browser source to be that. You can go even further with this with very minimal setup. Highlight, copy, and boom. Really awesome effects that you can do on your stream. These are really powerful effects that you can do with very little manipulation on OBS's side. I think this is an incredibly powerful tool that you can do amazing things with. Go try it out and see what you can make.